What is going on, Puck Nation, and welcome back. This is part two of picking up gingerbread um, cookies. So, we finally figure out how to spawn it. You gotta go to this board, and press R, click on your output, and you spawn it down here. You can also do it with left control and then G, and then coming down to the, the actual facility. And I'm back with Chris from CW Gaming. So we got our two trailers and let's get going. And then these you can uh, stick it on the back of the trailer and then strap it down. And then for now at the warehouse we're going to have to use the outside dock. But I'll just go into Giant's Editor and fix the door swing. So I hope you guys enjoyed the first part of this video. Sorry for the little cliffhanger. Don't want to keep you guys waiting, but hey, we get another video out of it. So, oh, did you get it? A little tipsy. Need to add a attacher joint to the back so we can put some weights. So I'm going to do a little advertisement here. Um, we have thinking about bringing the mod team back. Um, my guy that made the uh, F-150 does not want to come back. You guys know him that made the Porsche and the F-150. So if you guys would like to join the mod team, let me know in the comments below. Uh, basically, we are going to be combining with Lambo mods. So anything we make... It's going to benefit his Patreon. If you guys are not a supporter of the Patreon, don't even comment 100%. Don't care. So, we all have our different opinions in life. So, I support my friend and what he wants to do because we're getting to a point in life where we can make money on the internet. So, it's not just at a standard job. Get off my forks. <laughs> yeah, it like glitches right underneath. So then you're like cradling it. And then you can also extend the uh, entire thing out. Because there's some cylinders. You can come take from this pile, too. I kind of just cleaned it up because when I spawned all of them, it was in, like, a pile. I want to grab two at a time, but my wheelbase. So we'll be taking a load to the warehouse, and then um, you guys have seen us unload many times. Let me know in the comments below if that's still interesting, or do we need to jazz it up? We will be delivering stuff very shortly. Just need to make sure everybody's not sick. Uh, Low boy is currently sick right now with bronchitis, I believe he said, but he is getting over it pretty quickly. And definitely join that Discord server because we had an event on Saturday. It was the 11th for a convoy and we only had one person show up. So 
let's be more active on that discord a lot of people were interested and now it's like oh you made it you you finally made it so i guess we're just going to avoid it now got anything to add on that cw Oh, yeah, you always find one of those. So with your guys' support and attendance to these events that we do, we will eventually do more of them. So, like, the live streaming, when I ended the live streaming, obviously, yeah, my internet does suck. But if the attendance was really up, like, you know, we got almost 10,000 subscribers. So if we were getting really good attendance, I could overlook the fact that my internet is a piece of garbage. But if the views are down, you just really can't look over it. And it's like with anything, you know, if it's a certain football game, NASCAR event, you know, if they start to get low attendance, they're like weighing the cost of all the stuff that it takes to actually make those events run versus how many people actually show up. Oh, there we go. Ha ha. Aw. Came off my forks. But this gaming channel is all about showing you guys that you can have a nice medium rig. You know, I don't have a super high-end PC, but I got my frame rates up there, and I'm still playing very comfortably. I don't need to be 60 frames per second every time I play this game. As long as I'm not jolting across the map where it's unplayable, that's fine with me. But awesome job to every... I think there's... Three people, two or three people that are making these pallet stuff, not the trailers and stuff, but we're just doing the production mods. And they're doing a really good job of fixing all their errors so that when you spawn these pallets, you're not, your frame rates are not going down as you spawn in more. That is one of the biggest helps because it doesn't matter how big of a PC you have, how high end, once you start to create lag. It takes your PC down quite a bit. So all you modders out there that keep, um, you know, keep uh, ignoring people about lag and stuff, it's it's real. So if everybody worked together and stopped all their lag, this game would be so much better. There wouldn't be no need for higher end PCs. Damn, you dropped one. It's like, in my opinion, I don't think anybody really needs two graphics cards of the same. Like, some people are putting like two 1080s together. Like, that's unnecessary. That just means that people are not taking care of their errors very well. So I think our ideas for these Christmas cookies is obviously you know grocery stores probably Walmart will get some of them and uh, maybe we'll make some local deliveries and maybe sell some to the um, what is it the market which is over here I'll show you guys and then there's also another factory that goes with this mod and it makes a bunch of like 
I think it's wine and stuff. Here's where you can sell them. Two little huts. So I think in the store. This is it. There's your bakery. There's your other factory. Looks like it just makes some wine and some punch. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> you can't grab it when it's on the forks either. I'm gonna straighten these guys out. Oh yeah, the one that yeah. Uh, Froze up in. <laughs> Thank you. I need to flatten this place out a little bit. HD modding definitely came up with a cool trailer here where that whole side opens. It's a cool little feature. Makes it for easy loading when you don't have a dock like we don't have here. Now I got one stuck. Oh, I think I got it. Yeah, get off. Get off. <laughs> I adjusted the forks, which kind of helped. Yep, I got it. Man, this trailer can hold a lot. Of course, I didn't do too deep. I only did one most of the trailer. Yeah, that's probably why it's going to take longer. Yeah. I would secure your load, then try to pick up the trailer. Oh yeah, that's skilled. <laughs> I grabbed two, but with only one fork, and I didn't get it high enough, so I was taking the second one off by another pallet. So I set it up on top of that pallet and then scooched in my forks. That's some skill. Alright, I think we gotta get a thumbnail here. There you go. Uh, I guess I can take one more. 
Might as well. Oh, thought I was gonna nick it. Damn it. <laughs> so close. Hey, if you guys would like to join the warehouse series, be a part of the recordings, let me know in Discord. Uh, please don't be annoying, just be professional about it. I did have to ban somebody off of the Discord for just being a fanboy, which I don't appreciate. Alright, looks like I'm going to have to hook up the truck to strap it down. Yeah. <laughs> I've had a lot of practice. It's not too bad. I've seen worse. I've done worse. Perfect. Oops. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Don't go too wide. had to scooch it in. It's like the trailer slides back. It's super weird. And then we just gotta hook up the forklift. So this forklift is, forklift is kinda like Lowe's or Home Depot. There's these forks. I don't even know what they actually call them. Like slots in the back of the trailer and then they just stick their forks in there and then lift up and then we have a convenient strap ah you gotta be careful with the game physics There we go. Much better. No. <laughs> yeah, that sucks. <laughs> Get it stabbing in the trail. It's okay, don't look back here. <laughs> Just have to get the uh, the right angle. Much better. Then you strap it down. See if I can get this one off for you. Can't believe we got almost all, all almost thirty pallets up. Shake it off of it.
Here, I'm gonna get to more even ground. Oops, didn't want to cross that. It might help if you actually had it started. <laughs> Kind of worked. Alright, come on. Get off. Alright, it's off. <laughs> So each time we come here or we drop anything off, because we will be dropping supplies off, not just randomly spawning them, this will be our setup. And as we glitch into the trailer, there's your load. Man, it's about time you're done. <laughs> I go grab your truck. Ew, put it right into the bank. Oops, did I do that? <laughs> uh, let me fix that. So this will be a hot mess. God damn it. Stupid truck. In my way. Alright, I'm going to have to carefully just lift it. There we go. You want me to do it? <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna pull, pull it out of this area. I'm gonna have to do some detail work to this area you can shut the big door man it made if they made that in real life oh that'd be so awesome probably low cars better into those into these trailers I'm going forward, but it flames me backwards. And there you go. Alright, let's head out. Head to the warehouse and drop it off in the yard. But as we ride back to the warehouse, hope you guys enjoy all the warehouse videos. If you have any ideas or suggestions or actually want to be in the video, uh, shoot it down in the comments below. And then also join the Discord. Discord is in every description that I produce. You went down the wrong road. Yep. 
But we got way more factories coming. We got light beer, dark beer, vodka. Got some other goodies. A lot of CW Gaming's goodies. Got some funny episodes coming with alcohol. And thank you guys for all the support on the COPPA video. I think that was a very appropriate video to do on Christmas. Get the most attention possible. I most certainly like my outro. Never get to do that. Only once a year if you really want to. Got a nice country drive out to the warehouse. Not a bad drive. Just the uh, little town didn't have room for a big ass warehouse. If you guys find any placeables, like any of the major restaurants, let me know in the comments below. I've seen a few uh, by David. Runs in a few Facebook groups, Starbucks. We already have a McDonald's, so. Yeah, we need to get that. Alright, here is the warehouse. Conveniently, Walmart has their trailers ready to go for some shipments that we're going to have to fulfill here in the next, hopefully, couple days. You can park anywhere. Probably go on the other side of the trucks. Where the Jack Daniels and beyond that is all empty. So that's like my empty section. With that, I hope you guys enjoy your day, and let's make 2020 an awesome year. So get out there and complete your goals just like I'm doing. Believe in yourself. Don't let people talk you down like some people try doing with me, but it's all good. That's just how they behave. We'll see you guys later. Peace.